What's up, what's up everybody? You got double do wrinkles today. What happened to me? I look, I used to, you look so handsome with that luscious beard and then this nonsense happened. I don't want to see this and no, no old Drew Bagel. I don't want to see you anymore. I can't take you anymore, old Drew Bagel. I can't. It's too depressing. It's too depressing. What's up? What's up, everybody? Uh, today, it's been the eight months since I did that video of uh, me talking about the most most wanted Nat Fives. The game has changed a little bit. A little bit. It's changed. Uh, World Arena is a thing I enjoy playing in now. Was World Arena even out eight months ago? I don't think it even was. Um, the meta's changed a little bit? Not really that much. Let's be honest, the meta has not changed that much. Uh, I got some of the monsters on my- actually I got one monster twice on the, that was on my wish list. I got, uh, Zyros, which was number seven. So, things have changed. My- my tastes have changed. I got certain monsters, I'm like, okay, maybe I don't need these other ones. It's- I've gotten most of my Nat Fives in the past eight months since this video. Three years of playing, most of my stuff is in the past, uh, eight months. Hopefully, we continue, because I'm so- I'm summoning this week. I've been saving up. Uh, and I spent money. And say like I got the three year packs and I've been saving up too. So hopefully uh, maybe we can pull something. So uh, maybe we can pull something on this on this week. So we'll see what kind of monsters are on Jubagel's new top ten most wanted nat fives. These aren't the best nat fives or anything. These are just my most wanted nat fives, the things that I want the most and why. Uh, there's some, there's, uh, of course, just like last time, this honorable mention. Veladrol is still in the honorable mentions list. Vel why, why, Veladrol, why are you always in the honorable mentions? You're good! Why do I always put you in the honorable, why are you never in the top ten? Like, never, always a bridesmaid, never a bride? I don't know. I would, I would so love getting a Veladrol, though. Don't get me wrong. Veladrol, uh, Poseidon Varad, I was, I, I thought I was gonna put these on the list, then I'm like, uh, you know what, I want this other one more. So there's another one that I want a little bit more than Poseidon Infrared. I guess, maybe, we'll see. Because I do have Poseidon on my, um... Maybe because I've been playing with the Varad on the one account. I'm like, I'm good. And I have Ganymede. I don't think they even... Ch they, like, the, the Ganymede... Varad was number... What was he on the old list? Nine on the old list. Um... And then they changed it. They're, like... No, they didn't change it. I got Ganymede, so I don't need Varad as much. That's why Varad is not on the list. Uh, Poseidon, kind of the same thing uh, as as why, but because uh, I got because I got Ganymede, I got lucky enough to get that. But anyway, those are those are some of the honorable mentions. The old list, the old list was ten Sekhmet, Varad, Kumar, nine Varad, eight Kumar, seven Zyros. Already got two of those. Uh, six Ciara. Five Ritesh, four Samoth, three Camila, two Tiana, and number one Praha. I really wanted Praha eight months ago. I still want Praha, but I don't know if that's like the one. Cause like, I would have already summoned if the, if Praha was the one I wanted. I'm waiting for the. When does the thing switch over? When does the uh, summoning stones rotation switch over? I'm gonna accidentally summon it, aren't I? Okay, so in a day, a day from now, less than a day from now, 16 hours from the time that I'm recording this video. Now you guys know when I'm recording it. Uh, is when Praha leaves and the Tiana rotation is uh, is gonna be is gonna be in place. So let's uh, let's see what my new top ten are. Let's see what they are. The new top ten, uh, cause things have changed. Like I said, World Arena is a thing now, so I kind of want World, and I kind of would like some Guild War monsters too. Zyros has changed so much in the way I play Arena. It, I mean, it's it's changed so much. Zyros is like. Two thirds of the time I'm using Zyros in in not not World Arena, um, regular Arena. Like that that monster changed the way that I played the most out of anything. Feng Yan too. Feng Yan under uh, underrated. Love Feng Yan. Love Feng Yan. Did not think I would. Uh, so this other list was like when Feng Yan came out too. I did not realize I was gonna like him as much as I as I actually do. But anyway. Let's get on to it as in typical Jubagel fashion, four minutes of nothing before the actual list. She said, Timestamp list starts at four minutes, 30 seconds. No, I'm still gonna talk for another two minutes. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, new list, new list, and I'll say where, where, why I wanna use them. Number 10, Bastet. Bastet, the water, uh, I was gonna say water polar queen, water desert queen. Water desert queen. So, I, I like to use, um, speed leader. Bernard, Megan, Lucian a lot. 
Bass is just a better version of that. She's just a better, she's improvement to a team that I already have. Plus she gives a little bit more, like I can use her in different things too. I can use her, like I really would not bring Megan into World Arena, I know some people do. Uh, but I really, that's not, I, I feel like she doesn't have really much going on for her first and second skills. Like one, like no, I would rather have an AoE with three debuffs. Thank you very much. Uh, then the and also the leader skill uh, I like better for world arena too. so it's, it's a nat 5 that I could use for my arena offense plus my world arena I could uh, stick her in there too and I see Bastet actually used a lot in guardian level world arena I would not mind her would not mind her man she's a really nice monster but it would just be a, an upgrade for something I already use all right uh, number nine Alicia Alicia for arena offense of course I need the right- actually I can still use Alicia with the team that I have right now. I would just sub out, again, just an improvement to a team that I already have. I have the Chiwu, Bernard, Galleon, and Zyros. I can sub out, I can take out the, uh, the Zyros and I can stick Alicia in there. A lot of high level plays, like, okay, what can we do to be anti-Alicia? Because you do see a lot of, uh, Zyros is still more used than Alicia for high level arena, but a lot of them are still like, okay, we still have to make sure that we don't, we can't be easily alicia which is a thing. El easily alicia See, you don't hear it as much as Zyros. Easily Zyros. That's a thing, right? That's a verb. It's like, you can Zyros someone. That's a verb, I guess. We can't, you can Alicia someone. Actually, I never hear anyone say alicia I just hear them say, oh, I just use Alicia against that, whatever. Uh, anyway, great monster. Uh, amazing leader skill for Arena as well. 44% attack power leaders, and she's she's a nuker, right? Uh, and she can potentially, if she kills anything, she can double nuke with the with the in the same turn. Awesome, awesome monster. So I really want I, that would be for Arena offense. Bastard would mostly be for Arena offense and a little bit of World Arena. Alicia would be for maybe also Bastard for uh, Guild Wars too. I guess in the same place I would use Megan because sometimes I use Megan in Guild Wars. Um, but Alicia would be for, basically just for arena offense is what I've used her for. Uh, number eight! Number eight! Stone, what was he last week? He was, last week? Last, what was he eight months ago? He was number five eight months ago. He kind of got pushed down to eight. I don't know why. He's just, I like, I desire him less, I guess. You know why I desire him less? Because Feng Yan. That's why I desire him less. Uh, Ritesh. Ritesh number because he's got that AoE defense break, right? He's got a heal. He's got an AoE defense break. He's got a provoke. He's a great monster uh, The only reason he got pushed down is Feng Yan. I was trying to think about it I just realized I'm like that's why that's why because I don't need Ritesh like I don't need you like I did in 2016 Ritesh <laughs> Oh man He's a great unit. He's uh, where would I use Ritesh? I would use him for maybe arena defense would be great in arena defense could use him maybe sometimes in World Arena. I'm not sure if I would use him that much in World Arena. I guess I could. I guess I still probably would. I guess maybe it depends on the team. Um, but mostly for Guild War defense, Guild War offense, and probably Arena defense too. I think those are the three places that I use Ritesh more than anything else. So that's why he's still, still on the list number eight. Number seven was this monster. Actually, number seven is kind of like, I kind of cheated. Number seven is any chimera. I just want them all. I want like any chimera. Any, and this is just a, uh, this is just normal elements. This is just strawberry, blueberry, and what is the, what is wind one? Strawberry, blueberry, and banana? Sure, banana. I'll take a banana uh, chimera. Why not? Strawberry chimera, blueberry chimera, or banana chimera. I guess it's banana is the thing now. Um, I think more since I have Tashar, since I have, um, the, the, you know, other wind nukers, I think I would much prefer to get the water one. I th wow, I'm weak in, in water. I'm weak in water. Like, the best, my best water monsters are, like, attackers are, like, Shihao, well, Theomars, too. Shihao, Theomars, and, um, who else? I can't even think. Julie! I use Julie a lot, actually. I use Julie a lot. So that's why I'm, like, Alicia, I would love Tower, uh, sorry, Blueberry Chimera. Names not, don't say names, don't say names, because you're gonna pronounce them wrong. Blueberry Chimera, would love. That's what I'm, I feel like I'm weak in water nukers, water attackers. So I love that. 
Uh, and Rakan, I would love to. Uh, very strong tanky fire monster. I could use Rakan in Guild War defense. Arena defense will be beautiful, maybe even sometimes in World Arena 2. Uh, again, like these are like flexible, like arena defense. You're seeing like a, a kind of uh, a kind of trend, like arena defense, guild war defense, maybe sometimes in uh, world arena. Anyway, that's number seven. Any chimera, blueberry and strawberry, a little bit more than the uh, the wind, just because I have a lot of other wind options. There's not a lot of wind on this list. All right, that's a spoiler. Spoiler number six, Perna. 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 Again, guild war defense. Arena defense. Also, I really want to try out uh, an awesome Dragons B10 Perna team. I think could shave some time down from my current team. Would be awesome. Would be awesome. I really have. I, I have. I have a, a strong feeling that the that Perna team that I have in mind would be fantastic for Dragons B10. But Perna. Number six. What was Perna last? Uh, Perna wasn't even on the list. Why was Perna not on the list the last time? I had Sekhmet on the list. Sekhmet over Perna? What was I thinking eight months ago? God damn it, Jiray. God damn it. No, but I was, um, I, I, Perna for Arena defense, for Guild War defense, and sometimes for World Arena. See, and now you got the, okay, what else, what else is on the list? What could we use in Guild War Defense Arena Defense and sometimes, uh, Live Arena? Hmm, okay, that's probably the last, the last six on the list. Number five, Camila. Still, Camila was three on the list before. She did get a slight change slash nerf. Um, Camila's still great. I would use, where would I use, I probably, again, would I use Camila in Arena, in uh, Guild War Defense though? Depends on what else I had. Depends on what else I had, and depends on the. I think I have good. I think I can make a good Camila. I think I have pretty decent runes for Camila runes. I think I could do a nice Camila. I think it'd be beautiful. It'd be lovely. It'd be huge. Uh, but I really still. I still want a Camila. Apparently not as much as I did uh, eight months ago, though. I don't know. She just seems less less threatening. I just want other stuff more. Alright, so Camila, number five. Again, for the same thing, Arena Defense, Guild War Defense, and sometimes World Arena. Okay, number four, of course, number- this was my number one! What happened? What happened? I really thought- I was like, man, I really, really want her. I still really, really want her, there's just other stuff that's so damn strong. Praha, number four. Great monster. Uh, Arena Defense, Guild War Defense, sometimes World Arena. Again! Again! Okay. Uh, super strong, she's got a heal, she's got a resistance lead, she's got a strip, and she stuns, and she gives herself more turns with her first skill. I mean, such a strong monster. That's where I would use her, though. I really wouldn't use her for arena offense. I wouldn't use Camila for arena offense, either. Maybe Guild War offense, because you know it's a little bit different. I would use Pra, Camila, Perna. Um, because it's like, it doesn't matter time. But, for... Really not arena offense. Arena offense, you just want to do it fast. You want to do it fast, fast. Uh, but Praha still dropped three spots. Praha, what's the matter with you? Uh, number three was not even on the- it was out! It was out eight months ago, but it's not even on the list eight months ago. It's not even- wasn't even on the list. Did not realize how much I wanted this, or how much I should have wanted this. Molong with the Droopy Dong, number three. Oh my god. Molong, strip stun, right? Leader skill, good leader skill. Strip stun is very strong. The defense break on the first skill is fine. Uh, and then just a snipe, just a tanky monster that can just snipe anything. Like, you, it, it's so hard to kill him. He's a dickhead. I hate Molog. He's a dickhead. He's one of the best World Arena monsters too. So where would I use him? Again, Arena Defense, Guild War Defense, and World Arena. More than sometimes World Arena, I'd probably bring him a lot. Molong. I would probably bring him a lot. Even though he's an HP monster, he gets less uh, valuable over time. He's still just so strong that he's so good. Because you can't, like, you can't bring immunity. He's gonna strip the immunity. He's a nice counter to immunity. He's gonna strip the immunity, and then he's just gonna, like, eat through that, like, any shield or any immunity. Doesn't need a defense break to do his nukes. He's like, he's like, the, the, it, he's like a, wow, words. He's like a high elemental that ignores defense, but he's also like 50,000 times tankier. Maybe not 50,000, exaggerating, but great monster. Number three on the list. I can't believe he wasn't on the list the last time. Number two, Samoth was number four last time. 
But they, like Samoth is just like I need other stuff too. Like I need with the Samoth, I would need a better stripper than Chiu. Chiu is really not the most reliable stripper. I really would need something else. I would need like a Juno or a Praha. I really would for for defense. For defense, right? I don't trust Samoth, uh, like Samoth Orion and and Chiwu for for defense. I don't trust that that's gonna hold up and do what I think it's gonna do. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna work. Chiwu is gonna be like first skill. Good job, Chiwu. Good job, buddy. Oh my god, Chiwu. Oh my god. Uh, but you see, if you if you hit Chiwu, if you hit Chiwu in uh, in arena, you see how much he derps on defense. He derps a lot. He derps a lot of times. Like I'm gonna use my second skill. I'm gonna use my first skill. Uh, third skill. I don't need that. I don't need to use that. Why, why, why would I need to use that? Uh, so yeah, but I would need with Samoth for defense. I would need like a Praha or a Juno, or or a Morlong, uh, more Morlong, Molong, or or a Light Panda. Just say. But I didn't include the Light and Dark ones. I didn't include the Light and Dark ones. Just like ones that are actually like maybe reasonable to get if I spend money, not ones that are like no, I'm never gonna get that. Like why even, why even bother putting it on a list if I'm never gonna get it. Right. Molong is amazing, though. Uh, World Arena. It's a lot more valuable in World Arena than... some. Not a lot more, but definitely more valuable in World Arena than the other ones that I mentioned. He's so great. Uh, no, I said Molong. And I said Samoth. Samoth, uh... Oh! Samoth for offense, too. I think would be... would be good. Uh, anyway, Samoth. Awesome monster. <laughs> you see Guardian 2 and Guardian 3 defenses. Samoth. Everywhere. Samoth all time. All day, Samoth. All day. Uh, anyway. So that's why Samoth. Number one. I mean, did we see this one coming? Did we see this one again? I, I gave it away in the beginning. It's Tiana. I gave it away in the beginning. Uh, Tiana was number, what, two before. Eight months ago, Tiana was number two. I still wanted her. Now she's upgraded to number one because I see everyone having an easy time. I have Chiwu. And I use the Chiwu Zaros thing, and I'm like, man, I really wish Chiwu worked better. He's still good, don't get me wrong. I would use a, I would use a different, different team. That, like, just having that Bernard skill, you know, Bernard third skill, plus Chiwu third skill, and the same skill... Is... Is, is nice. Is nice. She's got an arena, le uh, arena defense leader. She's got uh, a, a defense leader for arena. It's just, it's it's easy mode. It's like oh okay, I've seen because I have Zyros and Galleon, right? So I have two thirds of the like the the OP combination, the winning combination. I need Tiana. That's that last one. I need Tiana, maybe a Samoth, and we're golden. Ciara, I know Ciara was on the list for number six last uh eight months ago last year. I know she was there. I feel like like here's the thing. Like I wanted Ciara back then. Still want Ciara, I would still be happy with her. I don't have Tiana. A lot of the people that want Ciara have Tiana. They're like, oh yeah, I just Ciara and Tiana and a bomber and GG or whatever. And I don't have I don't have a Tiana. So Ciara is like, I still need a stripper, I still need all this other stuff. Like, yeah, I could do okay, I could do Guild War defense, I could do Ciara Orion X. But people are getting people are getting counters to that too. But like a lot of times it's like, okay, you like Perna or Rakan, things like that. The, the Leo even uh, is what they is what they do. So I don't have I don't have Perna, Rakan, or Leo. Not Leo. Uh, Laika. Sorry. My bad. Oh my God. Jubega doesn't even remember monster names. Uh, so that's my top ten most wanted list, guys. Tiana just makes everything so much easier. I wouldn't put her even on defense. I would put her. I just I don't know why I don't I don't feel like I would put her on defense. I see some good Tiana defenses. I just don't think that that's what I would use. I would use Molong and Paraha, Camila, Perna. I would use those on defense. There's Tiana's like an easy, easy offense one. Plus T I mean Galleon, Tiana, Zyros, Guild Battles. I would like oh, that less stress guild battles now, less stress, no worries, outspeed, nuke them. Watch as Zyros gets resisted and doesn't crit on anything, and then rage again, and then have to summon again. But that's guys, this way, uh, it's it's the reality of the situation. Jewbagel with the damn beard. I hate you. I'm so jealous of you. I'm so jealous of you eight months ago, but you're jealous of me because I got Zyros. So 
it's a give and take situation. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I know you're gonna be like, dude, I got, I got that monster. I got that one. I got that one that you want. I got it. I got it. But screw you. Uh, whatever. We're gonna summon this week anyway. Uh, I don't think we're gonna get anything crazy. I, I was trying to save more. I didn't buy any premium. I have 150 scrolls at right now. I really need to have at least 200. Um, but I didn't get any premium. I bought stuff. I bought the packages, but I didn't like use the crystals for premium packs yet. I could still do that. I just don't want to. I don't want to. I want to like just farm giants, and dragons, whatever, and get the scrolls from that. I really don't want to. I want to use the premium packs, but I want to get. I need to get more scrolls. Otherwise, it's not going to be as fun. It needs to be fun, right? Any excuse for me to spend more money, right? All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, bananas, and I will see you guys as always in the next one.